going on i'm back again for another video today um it's another tutorial i have built here a sugarcane farm that produces a very good amount of sugarcane but you do need a lot of bone meal this is seven stacks of bone meal but it goes through so quickly so let me show you how it works and then I'll go through a step by step thing to actually show you how to build it. So what it does is this just produces it so the bone meal goes into the tree cane and that's detect and the tree cane growing is detected by this observer which makes the piston go out. But the main thing is the storage system is hard to make because often things fall onto there oh whoops oh it's breaking the piston there we go. yeah often things fall onto this block here so you need to use some pretty good things to do that so for this design you will need four hoppers well you need a hopper minecart a few hoppers there and then a few for your storage system so i'd advise bring about 10 hoppers um bring about 10 chests um you need a piece of sugar cane something for the sugar cane to grow on and there you go there it stops now because all that bone meal has been used up on getting this much more you can actually make it a bit more efficient if you just stem this a bit because it is currently not the most efficient design. Ah, I see what I've done. So you do that, and then it'll all look like this, and then you just break it and replace it, and it'll go a bit more steadily. So I would advise building this design. It's a lot more efficient on bone meal. Um, right, so let's get into building this thing. Actually, uh, you need torch. You need a torch, uh, sugarcane, the block for the sugarcane to grow on, so dirt, um, or sand if you want but it doesn't actually make any difference because it doesn't actually make any difference what it grows on that's one of the biggest myths in minecraft um need a piston <clears throat> an observer and then all the stuff for this you also need so bring one two three four five six redstone and four repeaters and that should be about it. So, I'll show you how to make it. First of all, what you want to grab is your hoppers and your chests. So, just this is actually quite odd. Start off with the storage system. So, well, kind of the storage system. It's, it's not, the one I'm building is tiny. Um, but you can extend this as much as you want so what you need is that and then two blocks outward you need two block, two running into there and a hopper there you also want three blocks around this and then place yourself in a rail and a minecart with hopper um, I don't know why, but sometimes it doesn't pick it up if you don't break the rail. So just break the rail, just in case. Um, and then place blocks all around it, like this. Then grab yourself your dirt block. Or, uh, I'm using dirt. 
You place it right there. You'll now want yourself a piston. If you build up to here and then place a piston. And then one observer. Observer. You'll want on top of here. Just place it from this side. And then place a block there and a block there and a piece of redstone on top of that. You'll also want this not here. Sorry, that's that's not right place. Not there, but there. Running into a dispenser. You'll want that there. You want that like that. And then repeaters just going like a bit like this. And then I showed you how to showed you how to activate it. Oh, you kidding me? I always forget you have to actually build this one along. Sorry, um, you have to build this one along here. Ooh. Don't want flower pots. You have to build this one along here. Um, right there. And that should work well. Oh wait, that's why. All these should be on four ticks. Is it four ticks? Is it four tick? No, two of them should be two tick. The other two should be three tick. Two of them should be one tick, sorry. The other two should be three tick. Like that. Now that should work when you break that block and place that redstone. Then you'll want to just grab yourself a block there to block out light. <coughs> I don't know why, but it seems sometimes not to work when you have natural light, which doesn't make any sense, but just block it off and you'll need to place a um, torch instead. Right, you now want your sugar cane on... Oh wait, sorry. First you want to get a bunch of blocks around here. So I would just advise placing in a lot of blocks up to this top section, up to the observer. And this is very small, so you can integrate it into your base very easily. Um, uh, you need your torch there. Your blocks above the torch. And this is fully FK, you don't need to like stand next to it or anything. So that's very useful. It is bit loud but yeah can't really change that then wanna oh just place that in place that in um and finally place in your sugar cane gosh oh no why have I done that finally place into your sugar cane um it's an extremely simple system very easy to build um and effectively uses um, effectively uses bone meal. I'm just actually gonna try and slow down the clock. That should slow down the clock. I don't know if that's slowed down actually. That looks better. 
Um, no, no, actually, I need bone meal. So what you'll want to do is also make a bone farm, just a skeleton grinder um, with this. You can see, uh, not go through there. Let's go through the top here. You can see it all growing. Actually, I need to reduce this pulse. That's better. And you can reduce it even more, I think. Yeah, that looks really good. So you'll want. I think, let's just try that, no, um, just go two tick on two of these, and this is perfect, it goes so fast, so that's how much we've got already, this is usually, I would use this for, um, making rockets um uh, rockets are just the best thing paper is used for it's also very early game so you can use it actually <laughs> to get your first enchanting set up um yeah this is just like a prototype um and i chucked some bone meal in there and there's a lot of stuff here this is uh, inefficient ones. This is the most efficient one. I'm actually going to alter this in a second um, in my survival world. This is incredible. Um, so what I'll need to do is just... Two on two and two on one. Okay, so that's this build. It's very simple. Um, actually, I'll, I'll place the, it doesn't matter where you place the torch, I'll place it over, and uh, do this, and that will be the end of this video, thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you all in the next video.